Hello, everybody. Here we are backstage at Hairdressers Helping Hairdressers, a wonderful charity this evening to raise money for the victims of Hurricane Sandy. And my name is Mark DeBolt. I'm a career colorist and an artist for Wella Professionals. And this evening, I'm here with Philip Ferreira, Wella's global gold medal Trend Vision winner for the color category. And Philip, would you like to tell me a little bit about what you're up to backstage? Thanks, Mark. Um, yeah, well, obviously we're here for um, hairdressers helping hairdressers fundraiser, trying to uh, uh, raise quite a bit of money, hopefully a lot of money for a lot of people in need. But uh, we're actually going to be doing uh, a haircut on Steve here uh, from Modern Salon. Um, and I'm actually uh, going to talk a little bit about uh, more on the longer, like keeping the male clientele with the longer hair as opposed to being always short, 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 and how to maintain it, really. So instead of actually doing uh, haircuts by, you know, like scissor or combing, we're trying to leave some length and textured length. So it could be quite a bit easier for Steve to manage his hairstyle and even more in the longer style, more into a shaggier uh, look for men. So let's uh, do, go into this. And, uh, Wonderful. Uh, obviously, very important. Uh, consultations is very important so I mean one of my main questions for Steve was you know what is it about his head does he like it long and short or and he liked to keep it a little bit longer so uh, what I started thinking about on, on Steve's hair is really keeping the length but really instead of cutting it uh, into blunt cutting just really texture every single section of hair so what I'm gonna do here on Steve I'm gonna start off here on the sides here taking a section and then what we do, instead again, instead of actually grabbing this and cutting all of this into uh, a blunter cut, what I do is I actually cut all his hair. As you can see, it's very blunt. So we actually just break up all his hair. So it removes a lot of the bulk for him, but it still leaves some length. So that way, all he has to do with this type of a hair or a haircut it would be just basically shampoo, uh, condition his hair, blot it, comb it through, put some product into his hair, and then uh, out the door he goes. Wouldn't that be great, Steve? That would be great. <laughs> so let me just uh, grab a little bit of water here. And the greatest thing about doing this type of haircut on an event like this is we're working with no mirrors in front, uh, which makes it a little difficult sometimes to make sure that uh, you got a nice even cut throughout, so all you got to do is just make sure that uh, you're doing a full haircut and double check everything, make sure all the sectioning is, is good throughout. So let me just keep wetting it a little bit. So, and we're going completely around the whole head. Just removing a lot of the bulk of his hair. So, and at this point, you can see it just makes it more messier of a look to get you more of a shaggy, broken haircut through it. How's that sound? <laughs> Perfect. Wonderful. Thank you so much, Philip, for sharing those uh, wonderful techniques and trends to share with our guests uh, this holiday season as everybody gets ready to celebrate. Uh, in a few hours, we're looking forward to celebrating hairdressers helping hairdressers. And all of those of you at home watching, please check out hairdressershelpinghairdressers.com to donate to the victims of Hurricane Sandy. And donate, donate, donate. Yeah. Lots. Thank you. <laughs>